it happened again. This time it's about Naya Rivera. I think that this guy whose name is Will Larkins who was on a newscast called News 8. He talked about Kobe Bryant and he still he still thinks since the last four or five or maybe six months now that team Z happens to report the deaths of others before getting confirmation from the officials. And what Will Larkins doesn't understand, once again, is that TMC has the First Amendment right to report the story first. They are a celebrity gossip news media. We have the right to do that. And Will Larkins now is officially trying to stop Team Z. He's officially trying to ruin the First Amendment rights. Freedom of the press is part of the First Amendment rights. Just like freedom of speech. Freedom of speech is part of First Amendment rights. And when you put those two, two freedoms together and you try to desecrate both freedom of the press and freedom of speech, you are literally going to be the one who's in big trouble. They got some people finally told him this cancel culture during someone's loss isn't going to solve anything. Just be the per person and walk away. Then he goes on and says Team C does this on a regular basis. They always cause more suffering for celebrities families. They really need to not be doing this. I mean, I hate to defend Team TMZ, but that just seems like a problem with people leaking information to them. I mean, what you're forgetting is that the point of tabloids Alright, anyway, sorry about that. Where was I? Oh yeah, right. Like, Team C is to get a story and run with it until it is until it's confirmed or denied. But also in America, there isn't a regulation to stop things like this from happening. When that petition was created by Change.org, I knew it failed immediately because... Even though it had how many signatures? About almost one million. It still, it still hasn't happened at a, at all, and you know, I think Will Watkins needs to. It failed. I mean, let's go back to the statement you made, shall we? Thursday, January 30th, TNC's founder 
Bobby Lynn said that he was in communication with Kobe Bryant's representatives before publishing the story. And then he went on to say, However, he announces that the families of our victims could have found out from Team Z's reporting or social media, which happened more than four hours before the official announcement was made. All families deserve the respect of being notified by the police, not tight blowing news. Well, your petition, Will Morgan's, failed. And as much as I want for you to hold people accountable, you're only you're only like in your teenage years, I think. I think you're just a teenager, so nobody's gonna listen to a teenager who who dresses up like like this, and gets away with it. I mean, seriously. If you can just do yourself a favor, and stop trying to cancel TMZ, then you'll be on your way. Stop making these failed petitions to get Team Z off the air. Because I happen to like Team Z. In fact, I am a Team Z viewer. And as a Team Z viewer, I do not appreciate you for doing the work that you're trying to silence Team Z. For freedom of the press. Freedom of the press is the principle that common communication and expression through various media, including printed and electronic media, so especially published materials, should be considered a right to exercise freely. Such freedom implies the absence of interference from an overreaching state. Its preservation, preservation may be sought out through constitution or other legal protection and security. The United Nations 1948 Universal Declaration of Human Rights states everyone has the right to freedom of opinion and expression. The right in this right includes freedom to hold opinions about interference and to seek, receive, and impart information and ideas through any media regardless of frontiers.